Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Felix Sanchez, Alumni Relations Manager at the Office of Alumni Relations, Division of Institutional Advancement. On behalf of the Hostos Community College family and our foundation, welcome to the fourth annual Alma Matters Awards. This year, this event is acknowledging and celebrating the accomplishments of our amazing Hostos alumni employees whose commitment and dedication have been creating a positive impact in our communities and most importantly, our students. And for this, we deeply thank you. Now, please join me in welcoming our president, Dr. Daisy Coco de Filippis. Muy buenas tardes. Good afternoon, Hostos family. I am Dr. Daisy Coco de Filippis, president of Hostos Community College. Thank you for joining us to celebrate the fourth annual Alma Matters Awards. This event gives us the opportunity to recognize the, list, the lasting impact of an OSTOS education, not just for a single student, for our entire community. This year, we are honoring the very special group of individuals who not only carry the wonderful pride of being an OSTOS alum, alumnus, but also dedicate their professional careers to the important task of serving our students. I am very proud to acknowledge the efforts of this remarkable alumni. And I would like to extend my sincerest congratulations to those who were nominated. Each of you has made tremendous contributions to this college and the dedicated students we serve. Today, our OSOS family comes together to celebrate you for being an important part of our college history success and present. Thank you and congratulations to all our deeds. And now I give you once again, our alumni relations manager, Senor Felix Sanchez. Thank you, Madam President. I would like to express our gratitude to those who played an important part in this year's event by nominating and voting for the serving alumni. The Office of Alumni Relations observed how multiple alumni received nominations for this year's awards and how the entire hostess community feels about their work. Each of them is making extraordinary contributions to their community and the hostess family is greatly proud of all of them. Before we continue, please welcome our acting provost and vice president of academic affairs, Dr. Charles Drago. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Dr. Charles Drago, and I am the Acting Provost and Vice President for Academic Affairs at Hostos Community College. It is indeed a pleasure to celebrate you as I have the wonderful opportunity to recognize the exemplary efforts you have made to benefit and assist our students. Your willingness to serve as exemplary Hostos alumni employees serves as an inspiration for many of us to work alongside of you every single day to secure the academic success of our student population. Today, I am deeply honored to acknowledge your work and what you have done for our communities. On behalf of the Office of Academic Affairs, it is my pleasure to celebrate you with those well-deserved recognitions. Congratulations to all. Now let's return to Felix Sanchez. Thank you. Thank you, Provost Drago. Since Hostos Community College is the number one employer of our alumni for the second time, we set out to highlight our own alumni employees at this year's celebration. Behind the uncertainties of the COVID-19 pandemic, there have been countless challenges as we aim to adapt our lives and what we all can do for our students. 
to all hostels, alumni, employees, thank you for going the extra mile, helping our students, and for your valued dedication to Hostos Community College. I would like to thank my colleagues at the Division of Institutional Advancement for their support and valued assistance helping me prepare this event. I would also like to thank our ambassador sponsor, Mr. Donald Almanza of Almeida Insurance for his support of our students. You may learn more from Almeida Insurance by visiting almedaonline.com. I also would like to thank this year's alumni committee without whom this event would not have been possible. Professor Damaris Lewis Lang, Professor Andrew Connolly, and Mr. Jason Litfield. Thank you for your diligence and commitment. And now let's take a moment to hear from them. Hi, this is Dr. Damaris Lois Yamoa Lang. I want to take this opportunity to actually acknowledge our staff for all their efforts in allowing faculty and students to continue. They serve as the engine that has been propelling the work of the organization. And I just want to recognize all their work, hard work that they've lent to us these rough times. I especially want to recognize the selected few out of our Hustos alumni that also serve as staff members here at Hustos. Congratulations for being selected in this outstanding appreciation of your efforts to, to the work of our college. I want to take this opportunity to thank you, your family, your loved ones that supported you to continue to serve us all. Congratulations. Hi all, this is Andy Connolly from the English department. I want to offer my praise for the remarkable work displayed by our alumni staff at Ostos, whose tireless efforts help considerably in our students' efforts to achieve their success. The alumni staff at Ostos are invaluable to keeping the college's core mission on point. Allow me to offer now singular praise for this year's Alma Mater's awardees. Well done all of you. You are a credit to Ostos, yourselves, your families, and indeed the wider community. We are truly lucky to have kept your valued intelligence and skills here at home at Ostos. Deserved praise is yours for continuing to bring your hard work and talent to the running of this amazing college. Thank you so much and well done. My name is Jason Lipfeld and I am the Student Leadership Coordinator here at Hostos Community College. And that means I'm responsible for something called the Hostos Student Leadership Academy. I wanna start off by saying congratulations to all the nominees and all the winners for the 2021 Alma Mater Awards. This is a wonderful opportunity each year to celebrate the people who graduate from our college and go on to do extraordinary things in the world, take on extraordinary roles in diplomacy, in education, in politics, uh, in healthcare, in engineering, and all of the under wonderful fields that you've gone on to. So I wanna congratulate you on, on graduating and, and taking on those roles. But more, I wanna say a special word this year about our nominees and winners. Everyone who was nominated this year and all the winners are members of our faculty or our staff. That means they're students who graduated from our college who came back to join the Hostos community once again and give back. And I value them not only for their contributions when they were students, but I value them as colleagues and as leaders in our community. So I thank you all very much for being a part of our community and making the difference that you make. You are certainly deserving of all of these wonderful awards. So thank you, and I wish you all the best. Thank you to our event committee for your kind words. Now to kick off our celebration and to announce the Trailblazer Award, Please welcome our Director of Educational Technology, Mr. Carlos Guevara. Thank you, Felix. Trustworthy, caring, humble, and dedicated are some of the many adjectives that this award recipient encompasses. As the Director of the Office of Educational Technology, 
I have witnessed his efforts that often go above and beyond his duties to serve our faculty and students. His determination and tireless drive helped us pave the road for a smooth transition to remote instruction during the COVID-19 pandemic. He was instrumental for the effective response by the ETHEC team, offering professional development and one-on-one -on -one support to faculty and students. Ladies and gentlemen, for the class of 2000, the Trailblazer Award goes to Wilfredo Rodriguez. I am extremely honored to be receiving the Trailblazer Award. This is something I did not expect. I am earnestly grateful for the recognition I have received for my work and dedication because I am sure that every other nominee was as capable of winning this award. Winning this award would not have been possible without the opportunity that Hostos Community College presented many years ago by allowing me to take college credit courses while learning the language and adapting to a whole new world. The inspiration I received from my supervisor, mentor, and friend, Isabel Lee, for whom I have the deepest respect and from whom I have derived the strength to challenge myself and be a better person and professional. I sincerely thank each one of you who made this event possible and gave me the opportunity and trusted me as professional for helping me reach a stage where I can proudly hold up this award as mark of my achievement. Thank you. Congratulations to Wilfredo Rodriguez. Now it is time to announce our Community Impact Award through our Director of Health and Wellness Services, Mr. Fabian Wander. Thank you, Felix. On behalf of the Student Development and Enrollment Management Division, it is an absolute honor to be here before you to highlight and recognize the remarkable influence from this alumna. After receiving her associate's degree here at Ostos Community College, she went on to earn her bachelor's in the same field and is currently enrolled in a master's in nursing program. As one of the first student participants in the Ostos Leadership Academy, her displayed passion to help others was beyond noticeable. After taking over as our full-time school nurse a few years ago, she has been a calming and instrumental presence on our campus. She has served this institution throughout the COVID-19 pandemic, always putting students, staff, and community first. She is extremely dedicated to the health and safety of the Hostos community, working long hours and weekends to care for our students, faculty, and staff. Simply put, we are extremely lucky and blessed to have her as our college nurse. Ladies and gentlemen, from the class of 2013, the Community Impact Award goes to our very own Nurse Maria Vasquez. I am extremely honored to be receiving such important Community Award. I am re endlessly grateful for the recognition I have received for my work because I am very sure that every other nominee from this award was as capable, if not more, of winning this award. I have faced several challenges on my way here at Hostos, but each one of them has only strengthened me to make me the person I am today. A thorough professional who knows exactly what she wants. Someone who sets her eyes on a goal and does not lose sight unless it's achieved. Winning this award will not have been possible without the inspiration I have received from my seniors colleagues, 
from whom I have the deepest respect and from whom I have very bad strength to challenge myself and perform better at each stage. I sincerely thank you, each one of you, who voted for me for this award. I will not mention names because probably I will forget some of you that is very important for me. But I will mention the departments that have been working here at Postos. First of all, my health and wellness department. Thank you for my colleagues for all your support. Thank you to the director who support me too. Also to the SDN department who support me since I was a student here at Postos. Thank you for all the colleagues there. Thank you for all your support. You know who you are. Thank you for your support. Also, uh, the nursing department, thank you to all the professors for all the knowledge they teach me. You know who you are. Thank you so much. You make me the nurse who I am today. Thank you for all your support. Also, thank you for my coronavirus team HR department, you know who you are, the staff there who works very close with me. Thank you for all your support. Also, to public safety department, who is part of my coronavirus team too. Thank you for all your support and thank you for helping me maintain the students, staff and faculty safe here at the campus. And also, I want to uh, thank you, the Leadership Academy, because I was the first ambassador here at Postos. Thank you for all the knowledge. Thank you for everything I learned from the Leadership Academy. Thank you so much for all who vote for me to make possible this award today. I had also promised to only get better at my work so that you can see me here for a more social award. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Congratulations to Nurse Vasquez. Now it is time to present our visionary award through our Director of Career Services, Ms. Lisa Ned Rosario. Thank you, Felix. This award recipient is indeed a visionary and impactful colleague whose extraordinary dedication to Ostos Community College and our students has not been unnoticed. Her professionalism, punctuality, friendliness, openness, and charisma have enabled her to connect with students, faculty, and staff to support the mission of Ostos and achieve her goals within the Career Services Office. She is proactive in supporting students with career development and matching to employment opportunities. She has developed programming for career success and has learned and customized technology used with students and employers to enhance services. She looks to find the best outcome for all involved and truly exemplifies the core values of Ostos. All in all, we are truly honored to have her in our team. Ladies and gentlemen, from the class of 2007, the Visionary Award goes to Ms. Dulce Hoppenberg. Hi, Hostos family. I am very excited and thankful to be receiving the Visionary Award. I am deeply grateful for the recognitions I have received and share these recognitions with my Hostos family and team for their own conditional support. I have faced several challenges on my way here, but each one of them has only made me the strong and the person I am today. As a strong professional who knows exactly what I want, someone who's tried to make everything possible. Winning this, uh, this award will 
now has been possible without the inspiration I have received from my seniors and my colleagues. For who has the deepest respect and from who has gained the strength or challenge myself and perform better at each time. I sincerely thank each one of you, especially Lisa and Rosario from Career Services and my Career Services team, my family. I want to include Lisa, uh, I want to include Linda Nieves, Madeline Cruz, Professor Nisa Flemiston, Professor Sandy Figueroa, Professor Elis Vasquez, hostess and hostess family for helping me reach out this achievement. I also promise to only get better at my work and continue helping and supporting our students and graduate. Thank you, thank you. Gracias, un millón. Los quiero mucho. Congratulations to Dulce Toppenberg. Now let's present our honorable mention award through our director of CUNY Edge, Ms. Veronica Vidal. Thank you, Felix. Much can be said about the following award recipient. This exemplary hostess alumna and mother of nine children has dedicated her time to effectively assisting the students who are a part of the CUNY EDGE program. Especially during this difficult and uncertain time, it has been imperative that our students get as much support as possible. Fortunately, I am so proud to say that she is always more than happy to offer such assistance to our CUNY EDGE students. Not only does she provide our students with the academic help they need to remain on track with their studies, but she also always checks in on their mental and emotional needs as well. Her hard work, her dedication, and her empathy are truly unmatched. Without further ado, from the class of 2010, the Honorable Mention Award goes to our very own CUNY EDGE advisor, Ms. Jennifer Williams. Congratulations, Jenny. Very well deserved. Good afternoon, hostess family, family members, and friends. It is with great pleasure and excitement that I accept this award. I feel honored to receive this award that you all have nominated me for. Hostess Community College has played a major part of my life and professional career. I started as a student in fall 2007 as a public assistant recipient with five children. While taking classes and working as a federal work study student, I was able to finish my studies and gain work experience with the help of my mentors. I became part of the COPE program, which is now the CUNY EDGE program, while still pursuing my education. I have faced several challenges on my way here, but each one of them has only straightened me to make me the person I am today. For me, being a hostess graduate means community and family. My hostess family always goes above and beyond to help our students, especially during trying times. This is why I have made it my mission to support our students in any way that I can, because I too was once in their place. In closing, I want to thank my former director, Ms. Maria Cano, who has always believed in me and till this day has pushed me to be better. And my director, Ms. Veronica Vidal, who has shown great leadership and empathy during these difficult times. Also, all of the staff, mem staff members that I have crossed paths with while I host those. Last but not least, I want to thank my CUNY Edge family. I work with a bunch of remarkable, strong, intelligent, amazing women who every day show me that giving up is not an option, no matter what the situation. And of course, my husband, children, and family. Thank you again for this award. I am hostos. Congratulations to Jennifer Williams. Now, please welcome foundation board member, Mr. Jason Caraballo. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Jason Caraballo, and today I have the honor of representing the Osos Community College Foundation Board. On behalf of the foundation, we congratulate all Ostos alumni and staff honorees, as well as the Office of Alumni Relations for this tremendous celebration today. As we all heard during the event, it is your remarkable accomplishments that serve as a testament to our overall commitment to changing our students' lives. Thank you so much for proudly representing Ostos Community College and its alumni in everything you do. And now, welcome back Mr. Felix Sanchez for closing remarks. Thank you, Jason, for your constant support of our students. 
On behalf of Hostos Community College, the Division of Institutional Advancement and the Office of Alumni Relations, thank you for spending time with us celebrating our wonderful Hostos alumni staff. We'll see you all next year to continue celebrating the power behind of our Hostos alumni at our fifth annual Alma Matters Awards. This is Felix Sanchez, Alumni Relations Manager, saying goodbye, stay safe, everybody, and have a wonderful holiday season.